court this morning for Bob Menendez, the longtime U.S. Senator from the state of New Jersey. Yes, he's set to face a judge on federal bribery charges. We're going to head over to lower Manhattan to court there with CBS 2's Zania Maldonado is uh, with the latest on this. Zania. Natalie and Chris, good morning. Well, Senator Bob Menendez will face a judge here at federal court around 10:30 today. Now he was hit with those federal charges late last week, but he has continued to brush aside the calls for his resignation and says he believes he will be exonerated. Now the feds have accused Menendez and his wife of taking more than half a million dollars in bribes from three New Jersey businessmen. They also found gold bars in the 69-year-old's possession worth more than $100,000, according to the indictment. Additionally, the couple is charged with involvement in a corruption scheme, accused of accepting bribes from American Egyptian businessman Walel Hanna in efforts to use the senator's power to increase U.S. aid to Egypt. Hanna was arrested when he arrived to JFK Airport yesterday and pled not guilty to related federal charges in court shortly after. Meanwhile, Governor Phil Murphy and nearly half of New Jersey's congressional delegation are demanding Menendez step down, which he says he will not do. New Jersey's junior senator Cory Booker speaking out yesterday saying this is not a first go around for Menendez. The evidence is pretty striking in terms of the case they have against him. Now that's in reference to the fact that this is the second indictment for Menendez. He faced federal charges back in 2017, although that resulted in a mistrial when the jury could not reach a verdict. We're live this morning from Lower Manhattan. Zania Maldonado, CBS 2 News. Zania, thank you.